the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Love you. Ooh, that's, you know, when, when you're getting into to, Ooh. to Ooh. anyone trying to put one race above another, mm. Mm -mm. you know, mm. you don't have to go through I'm a come out this try. You don't Ooh. have to do, you know, come um, on now. You, you don't have to, to, to go through the sun. Ooh. You know, you, you, you can just bypass everything. Everything. And go to the beginning. Come on, man. What was the what was written? You can just you don't have to know a whole lot of scriptures. You don't you have don't. to know the old testaments to, to, and, and to know how to break them down Woo. to figure out the genealogy Come and on. the process of, of what happened and how people became who they are and what mm. race became what race. Mm. Go all the way back to mm. the beginning. To the beginning, brother and just say, <laughs> let us make man. It is wow. written. It, it is, is written. written. Now, it is written. if you got some scriptures <laughs> <laughs> that precede that. <laughs> Tell, show it to us. Show it to us. Show it to us. That's show what it to me. I'll be like, Jesus, show me. <laughs> Come on now. <laughs> Yeah. But he, you, but he you said, must be sure Yeshua manifested in his flesh right now. Hey, look, I like the part of what it says, and he changed not. Yeah. So, so whatever you're going to show me should be consistent with what is written. It, it has it, to be. It has to be. He, you know, he said, and, and, he, and it, 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 it just requires woo. any believer, anyone mm. who believes. Mm. In Yeshua, yes, to sir. Fall in line. You have to, you have to submit because what is written mm. is Yeshua. It's it's a form of Him. It and is. if you believe in Him, then you believe in the form, in the Come types on. and shadows Come of on, Him. Brother. You believe Come on. in the the living Word. Come on, because man. the written Word, all it does is describes. The living word. Living word. And I like it. The living is like, like a life in it. Right. Yeah. And the thing is to see, that's when we can start putting and turn down some walls. Remember, I think that's what he said. Remember that said the weapons of warfare not cardinal, but mighty yeah. through God for the pulling down of strongholds, casting down imagination. Right. And everything, every high thing to try to exalt itself against the knowledge of God. So when you talk about racism, you you deal with that by the word. See, the weapon is written. It is written that I'm I'm made in the image of God. I don't know what you what you're trying to say, but I'm made in the image of God. Mm -hmm. And I know you want I know you want there when He created heaven and earth. So I'm gonna go by what's written. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? And and then and I want to go by what He says I am. That's oh man, people people please get this. Whoever and pass on to somebody else. This this one of the most. I, I still think this is one of, one of the most important messages we get. <laughs> but actually, all of them are important as long as we put them in the context of what is what is written. So, uh, man, I like that. That's just something that makes us feel better. Especially somebody go through a depression or something. Go by what's written. Go by the fact that he said, the just shall live by faith. So what is your faith telling you? Because you're depressed based on what you see. You depress them based on your senses, but if you focus on your faith, faith is the substance of things. Hope. Oh, in the evidence. Depression, depression, depression is based on what you see. Yeah. Yes, sir. Come on, bro. Go ahead, sir. I'm sorry. And let them have dominion over the fishes, over the fish of the sea. Did you put that likeness in there? I want to make sure, man. Let yeah. them get that too. I did. Man you did our image after uh -huh. our likeness. Okay, gotcha. Okay. Matter of fact, I want to. You want to look at the image or likeness? I want to look up the likeness. Go ahead. Tell him what look. Tell him what look like likeness. He's looking at the concordance people. I, I, if he if he think it's worth it, I'll bring it up and show it to you. 
resemblance. Woo. Concretely, the model. Woo. <laughs> the shape. Woo. Woo. Adverbially likeness. Woo. Fashion like and matter the, the similitude. So I, I, I like those words. Ooh. So we yeah. resemble. Come on now. You but that, that's from the concordance. That was from concordance. That, that, that's it. That's that's the Hebrew. I may I made it. I may even put that slide in there. So I'm gonna edit it. <laughs> just, <laughs> just just to let people see it. But like I said, we're made in the solemnitude. Yeah. Of him. <laughs> Woo! It is yeah. written too. That's written, people. That is written. Wow. And what you and got? Right. He, he gave you what? It says, he gave us have dominion mm. over the fish of the sea and over the fowl of the air and over the cattle mm -hmm. and over all the earth mm -hmm. and over every creeping thing that creepeth upon the earth. Now, I didn't see he said have dominion over man. No. I, I, I didn't even no. see him say, some people want to sit there and call sub man. I, I don't even see him say anything. Over man, sub no. man, lower man, red no. man, he black does not man. Say any I, of that. I, I didn't see and, none of that, did you? You know what I like? Was Because this was the beginning. <laughs> so there was no need for plural. Ooh. <laughs> because I, I started to add the S <laughs> to the ends of these and I had to stop back. This was the beginning. This is the beginning. Yes, sir. It says dominion over the fish uh -huh. of the sea. Yes, sir. <laughs> Not seas or right. fish. Over the fowl. Come on, man. Of the air. <laughs> over the cattle. <laughs> <laughs> and You're right. Over all the earth. Yeah, all the earth. The earth. Yes, sir over the regions or the landmass or the nations but yes, sir. over the earth over the earth and mm. over every creeping thing mm. that creepeth upon the earth and those creeping things are not made in the image of God are they no. those, creeping, those creeping things are not made in likeness so therefore those people you no. know some people the, come to check this out neither were the fish mm -hmm. or the or the cattle. None. None of those were made in those images. But guess what? Guess what? They became we... gods. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. They became images of God. Mm. That that's what's sad. Mm. Mm. You know, uh it, it would have been better mm. for them to have made to have fashioned a golden man, mm. which was you the don't... image made in the image of God. The gold, he's talking like then, the golden a, calf, then a, people. Then a calf or a yeah. beetle Ooh. or a bull. Or even a fish. Or because a I fish. think this, this is some of the, some of those pegging Or a combination, the, you know, the mentor yeah. or, or, or Minotaur, whatever. yeah, yeah. In other words, everything that was not made in the likeness of image, some mankind made those as gods. Yeah. Or resembling the symbols of God. And yet the scripture made it that we you that's interesting. You ever know that they didn't I think I guess in uh Nebuchadnezzar's when they did a statue, right? With that statue. Yeah. yeah. That or oh, that was a dream. I wanna show with that temple when he they, they put sun up there and they told him every time that the temple and the blah blah blah. Yeah. I don't know if it was they, a statue. They wanted to face it and, and, and bow down and, and, and worship. And worship, yeah. And that's something which it yeah. goes back and they say, Thou shalt another God before me, but that's yeah. another story. But the thing is that the, the key to it is when people sit there and, and try to put people down and say, You know, I have dominion over you. No, you don't have the not, it is written that you don't have dominion over me. That's written, you know what I mean. You can sit there and call me a creep. You can sit there and call me sub. You can call me property, whatever you call me. But I'm going to go by what is written of who I am. I'm made in his likeness, in his image. And if you don't know what that means, let me tell you something. John 4, 24 says it again. God is a spirit. And those who worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. The body that you see me, the 
body you see, Brother Addison, those are just vehicles for him and for me to transport and operate in this world. These are transportations. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's all these are. These are all transportation. And they will expire whether we like it or not, whether you like it or not. I'm talking about people out there, your body that you have, that they will all expire yeah. one day. Shelf unless life. Christ comes back. They were given a shelf life the moment. Mm, mm, mm. Sin crept in. Yep, called that cycle of life. Amen. Now we look at 27. You was trying to make you were trying to bring that point out. Okay, in 27. so God created man in his own image. His mm. own image. Mm. In the wow. image of God created he mm. him. Male. Yes, and he did. Female. Yeah. Created he male. He still didn't say nothing about no color, did he? Or no. we, uh, in, uh, we, um, he didn't care about where you came from. He yeah. didn't say where you, he, nope. He just said, in the beginning, just like you putting that word S, no S was in there. Man. Mm -hmm. Man. And, and male and female created he them. Human being. And his likeness. It is written, we all. See, that's why you that's why it is important for people to know what's written and for people who sit there and think that they both important by their flesh. He never said anything about that in here. But one of the people brought the flesh up is are you? You know what I mean? <laughs> what are what are you? What are you? What are you? An African American? What are you a white Amer European American? Or whatever. You know, I think people I brought it up. They put precedence on it, on on the color of the skin because that word uh, image mm -hmm. yeah it it's says it's cardinal. from an unused root meaning to shade to shade yes okay so did that mean fashion though or something we said shade huh? did that mean shade meaning like you like a you know like a sculpture or something or what do you mean the shade, the shade of, of of color like, oh okay okay so uh resemblance uh -huh. you know but the, the root of that is the to shade like huh. to, to, this this shade of color okay okay or the shade of of, of pigment or whatever that, that's what i'm thinking but uh maybe that's why people are putting so much emphasis on that now but back during these particular times, there was it was the color of man was not even mentioned. No, no. for a long time. Right, and my fact, you think about it, it didn't come until about 14, 1500s. But one of the things is that all the other creatures and all the other creations have yeah, multiple nobody colors. Talking about their colors. They got they got different colors. What I'm saying is that I, I, I said it a couple of weeks ago was God's masterpiece. Yeah. As a painter, as an artist, he colors a part of his masterpiece. The 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 the, the he talking about the glory. He talking about Mr. Solomon. All his glory is not arrayed like one of these flowers. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's, yeah. it's, it's the whole you creation. Know, the fact that. that he gave us the ability mm. to see mm. different colors, yes, textures, sir. shapes, yes, sir. sizes. Yes. He could yes. we, we could have just been seeing in black and white. We could have been just monotone, yep. Yeah. We could have been just black and white. This earth could have just been black and white. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I saw a movie it, made like there, that once. There, <laughs> there's an importance in the <laughs> array of colors. Uh-huh that we see and that we we find ourselves i mean there's colors that we are you see nowadays especially like on vehicles that you've never yeah. seen before y yes sir i've seen the new shades of color yep yeah new and so th there's just an array of co there's probably colors we have yet to even see i know because the spectrum of light doesn't allow us yes, to sir. actually so, visualize yeah. it yeah but yeah. if you if you find a way to fracture light 
mm -hmm. you know, in, in such a way, they're, that's where I think they're finding these these new colors. And, and yeah, they, and stuff. they just blend them in. But you yeah. know one thing, I do want to say, to say that, is that it, it creates, it's just beauty, is what I'm trying to say. You know, the, the differences, it's just based on beauty. It's, it's, a, it's a, just a, it's just some, I call it a masterpiece piece. You know, we like, I don't know if I want a black and white picture. You know, <laughs> people love colors. No, that, you, now I've seen some awesome black and white photos. Mm -hmm. Some awesome black and white landscape. Matter mm -hmm. of fact, when I was up in uh, 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 Iceland, mm -hmm. there's a beach called Black Beach where it's just the dirty black and the the water is a silvery grayish color okay. and the day that i actually went there to 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 view it there was a fog in the air mm -hmm. so it was real eerie because everything was black and white there was no color in that particular area there was okay. none at all except okay. for me and mm -hmm. the person who was there with me yeah and the clothes that we had on everything else was was eerily black and white wow so i mean and it, it was beautiful though okay but it was okay. eerie because it was it was void of color see yeah darkness you know really like yeah. darkness or light right in this case i said that's what i'm saying i think is did, did we should appreciate the uh the differences in the shades and shapes and size of human beings, just like we appreciate the shapes and size of animals. You know, you got black horse, you got a white horse, you got a red horse, you got a, you know what I mean? Dog mm -hmm. and you got, you got a fat, you got a fish, even the fish got different colors. Yeah. It's just different a sizes. I mean, just everything same. has its purpose. I mean, you, 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 you can't look down upon a small person because there might be a crack in a hole that only a small person can get to, to get you to the life-saving resources. Exactly. And then you can't be looking down upon a big person because they may need to get over something mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> for yeah. the same purpose. So yeah. everybody's size should not account. Everyone's stature should not condemn them. It you should know, not their, condemn their, them. Their, right. their, their color should mm. not condemn them. Nope. So if you look up on the... the, the what did what did MLK said? Not the You've color of, 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 yeah, of, of, it's the content of his character. The content of his character. It is though, and that's what God is trying to say. Because God said He looks at the heart of man. He yeah. doesn't look at the outward appearance. He said that a couple of times. I, I don't look at the outward appearance. Yeah. I look at the inward appearance because it's the inward appearance. It's what's in you? Your spirit is what He's. That's what's going to go before God. You know, and your soul gonna go before God. We like to, you know, I, I was thinking the other day that a lot of cases people like to highlight, emphasize negatives or whatever they call blemishes on other people to deflect from themselves. Yeah. You know, if I can sit there oh, and focus yeah. on you and, and make you look bad, then that makes me look good. Cause you're not focusing or on me. It takes, the, it takes the focus off of you. That's the whole purpose of it. And I think that's what all those differences does. And that's what God is saying. I don't look at you, your outward appearance. I look at your inward appearance. And that's what we want to be able to point out here. Is that what's written. And that's why I think this will have some people even going through depression. What does, what's written about you? What it says about you was written. And what do you got right here? It says 28. Oh, um, did you finish? I don't think you finished it. I don't want to. No, I you, did. Okay. Yeah. You did? It says, uh... Male and female created them, yeah. So 28, yeah. what you got? It says, and God blessed them. So I think we should stop right there for a second. Yeah. Is that and important? God blessed them. <laughs> <laughs> Is that not important, people? That, that's important. You were that's created important. to be blessed. You were created... Let me get off for a second. Let's see if they can see it. They can see it fully, Brother Addison, here. You were created to be blessed. Are, are y'all reading, hearing what is written? It is written that you, from the beginning, to be blessed. You are blessed by God. You are loved by God. You're made in the image of God. You're made in the likeness of God. You are what God called you to be. 
it's just our separation and the mistakes and the fall of the nature of man. But to be, from the beginning, it is written, you're blessed. Blessed. Oh, man, come on. And who don't want to be blessed? So I like the fact is that just people catch that piece that you are blessed because it's written you're blessed. And, and I just want to make sure people understand that so that you're not cursed. You know how the people want to sit there and point out the curse, right? They all put out, what, what is the beginning? What was his will in the beginning? His will in the beginning is for you to be blessed and to be in his image. And that's why I think you go all the way to the New Testament is be ye transformed. Be not, don't be conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing your mind. He wants you to conform. And what script that did, did, was that the script in there? No, it wasn't. I got another script coming up after that that sit there and said, conform to the image of his son. Yeah. Because his son was blessed, he is blessed. He is blessed. Come on now. And no, he wants us to get, he trying to get us back this, to this, this point. Is, this is uh, <clears throat> what even stands out more. Mm -hmm. He didn't bless the fish. Mm -mm. He didn't bless nope. the fowl. Nope. And he didn't bless every creeping thing nope. that moved upon the earth. He nope. blessed man to be over. Yes, he did. Earth. Dominion. And those things become blessed because of us. Yeah. You know what I mean? They're but sanctified by us. Yeah. Yeah. And you know, that's what I'm saying. So we are blessed. And then he told us to be. And then he said, be fruitful. Be fruitful. Uh-huh. You know, and multiply. And, and, and <laughs> but be fruitful and multiply. And multiply. I don't think the, the, the fruitful is the multiply. Yeah, the I think I think it is, is is be the fruit of the spirit. Come on now. Bear I'll, fruit. <laughs> hey, I think, I think another scripture was it profitable. Be yeah. profitable. Multiply. Yeah. Yes, sir. You know, because he's saying it right. Once again, it is saying what? So do it. And then yeah. the replenish part, that's what we talk about that gap theory, meaning you had to have been replenished and then you're now being replenished. Something happened. And we don't watch out for this uh, Putin thing. We're going to sit there. <laughs> we might end up doing it again. We, You know, if it's the wrong calculation, you end up doing it again. Replenish the earth, subdue it, and have dominion over the fish of the sea, and over the fowls of the air, and over every living thing that moves upon the earth. You human beings, not one human being over another. No human being was given dominion over one another. That's what is written. And those people who want to make that and say otherwise, you can't override these words. And that's what I like about the fact is, even Martin Luther King said, go back to what's written. Go back to what you put on paper. Stop lying. If you if you're gonna if you if you if you're lying and you want to go to hell, and you want to teach your children to go to hell, go teach them. I was saying the other day too, somebody was talking about remember they, they were saying they don't like to uh, use our true history because it makes somebody feel bad. And 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 I think I told you last week or we last said it, well, what do you think it make God think? <laughs> you, you know what I mean? If, if, if children, if your own children, out of the mouth of babes, right? <laughs> mm -hmm. If your children is saying it makes them feel bad, what do you think God thinks about that? Yeah. And I think you would be more focused on what God thinks opposed to you trying to focus on trying to hide something from your children, which you can't do anymore. So This is the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things He's done in our lives. Hallelujah, praise the Lord.